right, we've talked a lot about tick pulse lately. One of the best ways to trade this is when the VIX is above 15. Here is the uh, nin the multi charts performance summary with the thresholds at 150, the stop losses at 650, no profit target, and the VIX above 15. And you see the equity curve for this. Low drawdowns. Uh, the number of trade, the average trade profit is high. So I like this average trade profit of 137. This is without slippage and commission, so you have lots of room. And here's the equity curve. Once again, you see the equity curves are right here. The max drawdowns are right at 3,000. And here's the performance summary, 41,000 in the last two years. And it doesn't make sense to do a monthly subscription, so you want to do an annual subscription if you do this because... Um, you have long periods of time where there are no trades, and so you don't want to just be trading, uh, sign up for a month and not trade for three or four or six months. And so you see the see the results here. 2017 was lower than normal. Um, as I mentioned before, we're missing some data on the NYC tick. First 13 days of October, the VIX is below 13 during that time period, so it wouldn't matter in this situation. But this is a one way to trade tick pulse that we haven't talked about before that really boosts the average trade profit.